Ciao friends! In this video, I want to introduce the Vertipack Analyzer features in DAX Studio. First of all, what is this name? Well, DAX Studio has features that can help you understanding what is uh, the content of a Power BI file or of a Tabora model. For example, here I have a Power BI file that is 7 megabytes, it's more than 7 megabytes. And I might wonder why it is so big, where I'm spending memory and file size for my data. Do I have a table that is big, a particular column, what is the reason? Now, DAX Studio has a number of information can, that can provide me to help understanding what is going on. And first of all, I have to use uh, one of these features that are in the matrix area. And uh, before everything, we have to make sure that this feature is enabled. So if you don't see these metric uh, buttons in DAX Studio, go in the options and make sure that uh, here you have the export matrix button feature enabled. Uh, currently is a preview feature. Now, once I have this, I have to establish a connection to my Power BI file. So I open the Power BI file that we have seen uh, on the file system and I can click on the connect button in DAX Studio to establish a connection. Once the connection is available, DAX Studio allows me to click on the view matrix button here, this button, view matrix displays this uh, pane that provides a number of information about the tables I have in my model and uh, the columns. These numbers could be very complex and uh, we have a separate video to describe in detail what we have here. But we can just mention that uh, the table size of sales is 17 megabytes, which is bigger than the file we have seen on disk. Why that? Because uh, once you open a Power BI file, the size in memory can be bigger than the file size on disk. There is some compression that uh, you lose once you import the data in memory. And uh, we have other details here that we describe in another video, and we see that the total size of this model is 22 megabytes, is three times uh, the size of the file. Uh, now, understanding this could be complex, and even though you look at the next video, you may say this is too complex. So you might ask uh, someone else to someone else to help you. And in order to do that, uh, we have other two features here, which are export matrix and import matrix. So all the information you have seen in the Power Analyzer pane can be exported to a file that analyzes a data file, a VPAX file. And I call this Contoso, and I save this. Now, this file is very, very small. You can see here that the file size of the Contoso VPAX file is just 28 kilobytes. Technically, this is a zip file that you can analyze, and we have another video that describes what is the content of this file. Why that? If you want to send this small file by email, you may want to make sure you don't have any sensitive data that you are going to share with someone else. And actually, this file doesn't contain any data, any row of the model. The only information that are there are the name of the tables, the name of the columns, the definition of the measures and relationships of the model, and uh, statistics about uh, the data distribution, how many rows you have, the, the size and memory of each file. Once I have this file and I send this file to someone else, then I can have uh, an instance of uh, DAX Studio that is not connected to the model. So even though I don't have access to the Power BI file or to the Tabula model, I can simply import the matrix file. So I have DAX Studio not connected to any database and I can import the VPAX file. At this point, I can analyze the same information in DAX Studio without having a connection to the real model. But this way I can uh, evaluate this information and provide suggestion to the person that I want to help that uh, doesn't know that, uh, for example, this column is the more expensive column of the entire model. So we have seen that uh, these features import matrix, export matrix, view matrix in DAX Studio are part of the, what we call Vertipack Analyzer, which is a set of features to help you analyzing the model in Power BI. Enjoy DAX!